In the depths of space, something waits that makes every nightmare seem gentle. A supermassive black hole, 40 billion times heavier than our sun, devour the equivalent of an entire star every single day. While another monster fires rude away stars at us like cosmic bullets traveling millions of miles hour. These are not distant fantasies, but real terrors lurking in our universe right now. Tonight, we journey to the most horrifying black holes ever discovered. From the stellar corpses that could spaghettify your body in seconds to the galactic titans that could swallow our entire solar system and still hunger for more. You will witness time itself bend and break. Matter heated to temperatures that dwarf the sun and gravitational forces so extreme they tear reality apart. Like and subscribe if you dare to explore the cosmos with us. Prepare yourselves. We begin. Music. Imagine a place where the laws of physics you trust completely break down. Black holes represent the ultimate cosmic nightmare because they violate every instinct we have about survival. You cannot outrun them. You cannot hide from them. Once you cross a certain invisible line called the event horizon, not even light itself can escape. Think of it like falling over the edge of a waterfall that stretches infinitely downward, except instead of water, you are falling through the fabric of space and time itself. What makes these objects so fundamentally terrifying is their relationship with matter. A black hole forms when a massive star collapses under its own gravity, crushing all that mass into a space smaller than a city. The result is a gravitational field so intense that it warps reality around it. Picture space like a stretched rubber sheet and a black hole as a bowling ball placed on that sheet, creating a deep well that everything nearby rolls toward. But here is the truly horrifying part. Black holes are not rare cosmic curiosities. Scientists estimate that our galaxy alone contains 100 million black holes, most of them stellar mass monsters between 5 and 50 times heavier than our sun. They lurk in the darkness between stars, invisible except for their gravitational effects on nearby matter. The terror multiplies when you realize how black holes feed. As matter spirals toward the event horizon, it heats up from friction, glowing brighter than entire cities. This feeding process creates an accretion disk, a swirling vortex of superheated gas that can stretch for millions of miles. The temperatures here exceed 10 million to 8 F, hot enough to strip electrons from atoms and create a plasma hell that would vaporize any known material instantly. Even more disturbing is how black holes manipulate time itself. As you approach the event horizon, time slows down dramatically compared to the outside universe. To someone watching from a safe distance, you would appear to freeze at the edge, your image fading as the light from your body gets stretched to longer and longer wavelengths until it disappears entirely. Meanwhile, you would experience time normally as you fall toward the singularity at the center. The singularity itself represents the complete breakdown of our understanding of physics. Here, all the mass of the black hole concentrates into a point of infinite density where the curvature of spacing becomes infinite. Scientists cannot describe what happens at this point, because our equations simply stop working. What makes this even more unsettling is that black holes are not just destructive forces. They play crucial roles in galaxy formation and evolution, sitting at the centers of nearly every large galaxy like cosmic engines. The monster at the center of our own Milky Way weighs four million times more than our sun. The stellar graveyard around us holds horrors beyond imagination. Every black hole begins as a star, but not just any star. Only the most massive giants those at least eight times heavier than our sun, can create these cosmic monsters. When such a star exhausts its nuclear fuel, it faces a catastrophic end. The core collapses in less than a second, rebounding in a supernova explosion so violent, it can outshine an entire galaxy for months. What remains after this stellar death is a corpse more dangerous than the living star ever was. The core, now compressed to densities that defy comprehension, becomes a black hole. Picture taking all the mass of Mount Everest and crushing it into a space smaller than a grain of sand. 
that gives you some idea of the incredible density we are dealing with. These stellar mass black holes typically range from 5 to 50 times the mass of our sun, but they occupy a region smaller than most cities. The event horizon of a 10 solar mass black hole measures only about 60 meters across. Yet, this tiny region of space creates a gravitational field so intense that it can tear apart anything that approaches too closely. The most terrifying aspect of stellar mass black holes is their abundance and proximity. Scientists have identified around 50 confirmed or suspected stellar mass black holes in our galaxy alone. But theoretical models suggest there could be 100 million of them scattered throughout the Milky Way. They drift through space like invisible predators, detectable only when they interact with nearby matter. The closest known black hole to Earth sits just 1,500 light year away in the constellation Telescopium. This monster called HR 6819 weighs about eight times more than our sun. While that might seem comfortably distant, in cosmic terms, it practically sits in our neighborhood. Most stellar mass black holes remain hidden in the darkness, but some reveal themselves through their feeding habits. When a black hole has a companion star, it can slowly steal matter from its neighbor. The stolen gas spirals into the black hole forming an accretion disk that glows with X-ray radiation. These X-ray binaries appear as flickering points of light that betray the presence of the invisible monster. The feeding process creates a cosmic dance of destruction. The companion star, typically a normal star like our sun, gradually loses mass as the black hole strips away its outer layers. Over millions of years, the black hole can completely devour its partner leaving behind only the gravitational disturbance of its own presence. Perhaps most disturbing is how stellar mass black holes can remain active for trillions of years. Unlike stars, which burn out and die, black holes grow stronger with time. Every particle they consume adds to their mass and extends their event horizon, making them more dangerous to anything that ventures too close. Your body becomes a noodle stretched beyond recognition in the most horrifying way imaginable. Speculification represents one of the most visceral terrors that black holes inflict on matter. The process begins innocently enough as you approach the event horizon, but quickly transforms into a nightmare of physics that tears apart everything it touches. The name itself comes from the way objects get stretched into thin, elongated shapes that resemble strands of spaghetti. The horror starts with a simple fact about gravity. It weakens with distance. This means that if you fall toward a black hole feet first, the gravity pulling on your feet will be significantly stronger than the gravity pulling on your head. For a stellar mass black hole, this difference becomes extreme very quickly. Picture yourself six feet tall falling toward a black hole with 10 times the mass of our sun. When you reach about 400 meters from the event horizon, the gravitational difference between your head and feet becomes equivalent to hanging an 800 pounds weight from your ankles. Your body begins to stretch as the tidal forces overwhelm your structural integrity. The stretching intensifies as you fall closer. At 200 meters from the event horizon, the differential force increases to several thousand old. Your bones begin to crack under the strain. Your muscles tear. Your organs distort beyond recognition. The process is not quick or merciful, but gradual and inexorable. But speculification does not stop at stretching. As your body elongates vertically, it also compresses horizontally. The same tidal forces that stretch you from head to toe also squeeze you from side to side. Imagine being pressed through a cosmic pasta machine that stretches you longer while making you thinner. The mathematics of this process are as terrifying as the experience itself. For a human body near a 10 solar mass black hole, the stretching force increases by roughly 6 million times what you would experience on Earth. No biological material can withstand such forces. Your body would literally be pulled apart at the molecular level. Different types of black holes create different speculification experiences. Smaller black holes are actually more dangerous 
because their tidal forces are stronger near the event horizon. A three solar mass black hole would spaghettify you well before you reach the event horizon, while a supermassive black hole might allow you to cross the event horizon intact. The process affects more than just living things. Spaceships, asteroids, even entire planets would undergo spaghettification if they ventured too close to a black hole. The only difference is the distance at which the stretching begins. Larger objects start feeling the effects farther away because the gravitational difference across their greater size becomes noticeable sooner. Scientists have actually observed spaghettification in action when black holes tear apart stars. These tidal disruption events create spectacular displays of cosmic violence as stellar material gets stretched into long streams of hot gas. Cross this invisible line, and you have just signed your death warrant in the most absolute way possible. The event horizon represents the ultimate point of no return in the universe. This invisible boundary surrounds every black hole like a spherical cage made of warped spasim itself. From the outside, it appears as nothing more than empty space, but crossing it seals your fate more completely than any prison ever could. The name itself reveals the horror. It marks the horizon beyond which no events can ever be observed by the outside universe. Once you cross this boundary, you become permanently cut off from the rest of reality. No signal, no light, no information of any kind can escape to tell the universe what happened to you. For a stellar mass black hole weighing 10 times more than our sun, the event horizon sits about 60 miles from the center. That might seem like a reasonable distance, but the gravitational field here is so intense that escape velocity exceeds the speed of light. Since nothing can travel faster than light, nothing can escape. What makes this trap so insidious is how normal everything feels as you approach it. You can see the event horizon coming, but you cannot feel anything special about crossing it. There is no wall, no barrier, no sensation of passing through anything significant. You simply fall through empty space that happens to be curved in the most extreme way possible. The true horror becomes apparent when you try to communicate with the outside world. As you approach the event horizon, any light you emit becomes increasingly redshifted, meaning its wavelength stretches to longer and longer values. To observers watching from a safe distance, you appear to slow down and fade away. Your image frozen at the edge of the event horizon as the light from your body gets stretched into invisibility. Meanwhile, you experience time normally. You watch the universe outside the black holes speed up dramatically as you fall. Stars live and die in what seems like moments. Galaxies evolve and change. The cosmic microwave background radiation gets blue shifted to higher and higher energies eventually becoming a deadly torrent of gamma rays that would fry any living thing. The event horizon also marks the boundary where space-time curvature becomes so extreme that straight lines no longer exist in any meaningful sense. Every possible path through space leads toward the singularity at the center. Even light, which normally travels in straight lines, follows curved paths that spiral inexorably inward. Perhaps most disturbing is the realization that the event horizon is not fixed in size. Every particle that falls into the black hole increases its mass slightly, which expands the event horizon outward. The black hole literally grows larger with each meal, becoming more dangerous to anything that ventures nearby. The event horizon represents more than just a physical boundary. It marks the edge of knowable reality the point where the familiar laws of physics begin to break down completely. In the heart of every galaxy lurks a beast so massive it defies comprehension. Supermassive black holes represent a completely different category of cosmic horror. These monsters weigh not just dozens of times more than our sun, but millions or billions of times more. They sit at the centers of galaxies like gravitational anchors. Their influence reaching across hundreds of thousands of light years to shape the very structure of their cosmic neighborhoods. The smallest supermassive black holes contain the mass of 100,000 suns crushed into a region smaller than our solar system. The largest discovered so far 
weighs over 100 billion solar masses, containing more matter than the entire Milky Way galaxy. These titans make stellar mass black holes look like cosmic dust particles by comparison. What makes supermassive black holes truly terrifying is not just their size, but their hunger. When they feed, they create some of the most violent phenomena in the universe. Matter falling into these monsters accelerates to incredible speeds, heating up to temperatures of millions of degrees. The resulting accretion disk can outshine billions of stars, creating quasars that we can observe from across the entire universe. The feeding process creates a hellish environment around the black hole. Gas and dust spiral inward at nearly the speed of light, rubbing against itself with such violence that it emits intense radiation across the entire electromagnetic spectrum. X-rays, gamma rays, and radio waves pour out from the accretion disk with energies that would sterilize any planet within thousands of light years. The gravitational influence of these monsters extends far beyond their event horizons. A supermassive black hole can gravitationally bind entire star clusters, forcing thousands of stars to orbit around it in tight formations. Some of these orbital velocities reach thousands of miles per second, creating cosmic hurricanes of stellar material. Perhaps most disturbing is how supermassive black holes seem to control the growth and evolution of their host galaxies.